Hey guys, what's up? It's Slimy Spencer YT here, and welcome to day six of Slime Inspo Week. This is a collaboration with Great Small Itty Baby, so make sure to go check her out, and also go check out our previous days, and stay tuned for our last day, which is tomorrow, sadly. So, let's get started. Today, I'm going to be testing if you could add toilet paper to slime and see if it turns out to be butter slime, because I really want to try this. Um, I did see Grace Small Itty Baby on her channel yesterday try this out, so I'm not sure if it will work with me. So let's just get on into the video. Alright, so obviously what you're going to be needing is some slime. So I just pre-made some slime here. It's regular slime. And I wanted to know if it could turn into like butter slime. This is a fluffy slime. It's kind of like a minty green color. I didn't know if it was going to work, so maybe it's going to go, like, from the soft slime to, like, a really hard slime. Like, just like butter slimes. Butter slime is pretty hard. So it's, like, opposite to opposite. <laughs> I just made this with some normal Elmer's school glue. Some shaving cream. And some borax solution, which is, which is just one cup of water and half cup of borax. So, and of course, for this part, you're going to be needing some toilet paper. Now, I'm probably only going to put like a tiny bit at a time. Because I really don't want to ruin the slime. This is so weird. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I didn't want to activate it too much because I knew a butter slime would be way thicker. I don't know if it's working. Is it working? I think I need to add more toilet paper. I have no idea why this works, but it did work on Great Small Itty Deets channel. And again, her channel name will be on the screen right now. I don't know if it's working out, but it is definitely getting less stickier. And it is kind of getting buttery-like. It's kind of like butter slime. But I feel like it's still kind of like a fluffy slime because I did add shaving cream. So I'm probably only going to add like a few pieces, probably like two sheets this is my second sheet so i'm gonna break it up a little bit this is so weird have you guys ever tried to add paper to like slime there's a lot of people online uh, like on youtube that do that but i've never tried it for myself because i thought like why would you waste your time because i thought i always thought that it would always fail Okay, it's currently not butter, but it is getting to the point where I could consider it butter. It's probably just because I added shaving cream, and sorry for the noises in the background. That's just, you know, house things. I might add one more sheet. I don't know how this is going to turn out. It's just weird. Maybe I'm doing it wrong, but it seems like... Even though maybe it might not be a butter slime, it's still a good slime. Even after I added toilet paper, <laughs> that is. So I will come back when it's kind of like a buttery texture. Alright, so definitely um, this does work, but I think it's just because um, I made it like a fluffy slime. That's why it's a tiny bit softer than butter slime. But it definitely is like a softer version of a butter slime it definitely spreads and it definitely acts like a butter slime you can see it spreads let me just get it from the top 
That's super good. Wait, let me get like a good angle. Yeah, that definitely looks like butter slime. It's just kind of sticky, probably because I did make it fluffy slime. But definitely, this definitely works. I definitely suggest this for you guys. It is a super, super great technique if you guys don't have, like, model magic or Daiso clay. Because Daiso clay, I mean, it's pretty, pretty, pretty much, um... Uh, that's a lot of your bucks gone. So I wouldn't spend my money on Daiso or Model Magic anymore because Model Magic is pretty expensive too. I mean, you guys really. So I think I just probably use like um, toilet paper from now on. Um, I think any substance like like any object or like anything like toilet paper, just like tissues or napkins. I don't know if it'll work with napkins. But probably tissue, tissues and toilet paper, anything kind of like in that family, I guess, kind of works. This, this is like super buttery slime. It's, it's actually really nice. I really like... I really like it. I probably added over 10 sheets, including right now. I don't know why I even why I even bother to break it up. It's probably just gonna like be be like put into little pieces with me just stretching the slime anyway. And it's so weird because I put in let me just say a lot of toilet paper and like I can't even feel it. It feels like it's just dissolved. Like I can't even feel it. It's like it feels like it there's like nothing in here. It's just slime, but there's like obviously toilet paper in here this is a great great technique i probably will never buy model magic or daiso clay anymore this is a great great substance substitute for um any kind of butter slime that you want to make so i definitely recommend this so thank you so much for watching this video. Again, I definitely recommend this for you. And make sure to go check out GraceMel8888. Her channel link will be down in the description. And make sure to go check out her days and my previous days. And make sure to stay tuned for day 7. Sadly, tomorrow is the day, is the last day of Slime Inspo Week. So I'm pretty sad about that. But maybe we'll consider making another one in the future. So thank you so much for watching. Um, I hope you did enjoy, and I definitely recommend this. This butter slime is awesome. Super great. Um, and thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye!